the afternoon. It's been a long time since I made one of these videos, so hopefully my camera will cooperate as well as my lungs. Uh, thought it'd be better to make a little sound demo for you instead of trying to uh, describe the sounds that this howler and this open reed distress will make. I'll start with the howler. These are very easy to blow, uh, but I am a severe asthmatic, so if I happen to run out of air, don't blame it on the call, blame it on me. Uh, I'm going to move down the tone board a little bit more, just a little raspier. Like I said, it gets pretty raspy. Down to the bottom of the tone board is really raspy. I don't know whether how it'll sound on it, this video. I know this call sounds a whole lot better in person, but what can you do? <laughs> Well, you got a little idea, anyway, of what I have to do. The distress, it uh, did a variety of things from uh, anything from a pup howl to uh, jackrabbit distress to fawn distress, birds, you name it. Been a long time since I did any bird distress. Bear with me, please. Like I said, uh, hopefully that'll give you a little bit of idea of uh, what each call can do. Uh, it's been, like I said, a long time since I made one of these videos. Uh, heck, until recently, I actually hadn't been making any calls all summer long, so uh, it's been a while since I had one in my mouth. <laughs> so I'm a little rusty myself. I appreciate y'all looking. Hope you have a fantastic weekend. And we'll talk to you as soon as possible.